Welcome to iLecture Online, and here's another good example of how to work with differentials to solve for something like this particular example. It says, a sphere is constructed with a radius of one foot. How much of an error can be made in the radius such that the volume will not change by more than 3%? So let's draw a little sphere right here. We realize that the radius is supposed to be one foot. But we're allowed to make a small error in the radius as long as the total volume doesn't change by more than 3%. So let's write an equation for the volume. The volume is equal to 4 thirds pi r cubed. And so let's now find the derivative of the volume with respect to r. So dv dr is equal to 4 thirds pi times the derivative of r cubed, which is 3r squared. And then this 3 comes out with that 3, and we get dv dr is equal to 4 pi r squared. Now, separating the differential. So dv is a differential, dr is a differential. So dv is equal to 4 pi r squared dr. Now, dr stands for a small change in r, and dv stands for a small change in the volume. So, since we're looking for the allowable change in dr, as long as dv is not any more than 3%, so that means that dv must be less than or equal to 3%, so let's take the limiting value of 3% that will then allow for the maximum area in r. And since we're looking for dr, let's solve this equation for dr, so we can say that dr is equal to dv divided by 4 pi r squared. r is 1 foot, dv is the allowable change or the allowable error of 3% and we're looking for dr. So dv is 3% divided by 4 pi times 1 squared and of course 3% is 0 0.03 divided by 4 pi and 1 squared is simply 1 and then with my calculator we can see how big of a change we're allowed to make in r. So 0.03 divided by 4, divided by 3.14159 equals, so we have an error no bigger than 2.39 times 10 to the minus 3, which is equal to 0 0.00239, and converting that percent, that is equal to 0 0.239 percent in the error of r. So the change in r can be not be any more than 0.239%. And of course, if that is a one foot, that would be no bigger than 0 0.00239 feet. So the largest error is equal to 0 0.00239 feet. And if you keep the error in r below that, your error in the volume will not be more than 3%. And that's how you use differentials to come up with those kind of answers. Very slick, very easy, very straightforward once you can follow this pattern. All right, let me try to come up with one more example of this. 